little uh, dedication we're gonna do for Danny. Um, Liz, Mel, and Jamie, members of the Twin Lakes community, thank you all for joining us today. Uh, the village Twin Lakes has asked us to gather today to remember the life and service of Danny Dieter. Um, I just gonna give a, a personal story. Um, 2007, we had, uh, 2006, we had an um, addition on our house. Put a master bathroom on. Well, first Sunday of February, my wife calls me. I'm up in the UP snowmobiling. And she says, hey, the water won't run in the new bathroom. I said, oh, no. It, it was about a 40 mile an hour wind. It was 10 below zero. I says, turn, all, turn the heat way up. Turn all the faucets on. I'll call, oh, Danny. I'll call Danny. <laughs> so I call him up. He goes over to my house, cuts holes in the in the uh, ceiling in the garage to access the plumbing. Finds that the wind had blown some insulation away from the pipes, and that's what was freezing the pipes. So Super Bowl Sunday, he comes to my house. Uh, just the kind of guy he was. <laughs> Aside from his long career at Jutino Construction, Denny served on the Twin Lakes Plan Commission for 11 years. While on the commission, he played an active role in seeing many projects come to fruition, including uh, the Thielen Annexation, Whispering Oaks, and Majestic Estate Subdivisions, and residents of that main right down here. Um, Denny always approached any village business with a smile on his face. Uh, besides his commitment to building a better community, Denny was dedicated to family with a son, a daughter, four grandchildren, and one great-granddaughter, and now another grandchild, very <laughs> recent. Uh, he often spoke about them and all, and, and all supported them in a, all of their endeavors. His pride in all of you was apparent to all who knew him. Danny did a tremendous service to, to the Twin Lakes community as well as, well as being well-liked by all. This tree was donated by Bob Livingston from Creative Edge uh, because of the respect and friendship he had with Denny. To the family and to the family of Denny Dieter, on behalf of all the residents of the Village of Twin Lakes, the members of the Village Board, Plan Commission, Park Commission, thank you for sharing Denny with us and for your support as he worked to build and shape our community. We are proud to honor and express our appreciation for the many years of service to Twin Lakes community. Uh, by dedicating this memorial tree and plaque in Denny's name. Thanks, everybody. Yeah, yeah, come on. Uh, Anybody wants to say something? Uh, uh, you know, all you know me I'm from a big family, and I have a lot of brothers and sisters, and I can't tell you, I'm not any closer. I'm, I love all my brothers and sisters, but I love Denny just like a brother and sister. The other thing I can't believe, the last two weeks, how many people have come up to me knowing it would have been a year since Danny, Danny passed away, and how much they still remember him and miss him. And even now that I'm driving on the white truck once in a while, they all talk about, I just still picture Denny going down the road driving and his phone in his ear and going like this and right like that. <laughs> and the gears, you know, and he shifts, it's, it's a, yeah, right, so it's not an automatic, so he's shifting gears at the same time and drinking a cup of coffee, you know. So I, I just, I just admired the guy, and he made my life for years. Like Jennifer just a said, lot too, easier. always waving. So, <laughs> I, and I say a prayer, and God bless him, and, and God bless the Dieter family. God bless uh, them. Thank you. All right. Thank you, everybody.